For the first time, the 35 organizations from 14 countries and 70 European experts working for the next four years on the European Food Nutrition Security Cloud flagship initiative have met in Vienna. In the framework of UN's Sustainable Development Goals, Food 2030, and EU's bioeconomy strategy, more than 10 million euros will be invested by the European Commission in order to build the food and nutrition security theme for EOSC, or the European Open Science Cloud. RTDS, as the project coordinator, has created the collaborative work environment needed to bring together all researchers and engineers involved in the project. What is FNS Cloud? Let's hear it from our partners. What is FNS Cloud? FNS Cloud at the moment is a project, but actually it's a community of like-minded researchers who have come together to make the knowledge and data that we have around food more available and more usable. So what is FNS Cloud going to be? What it's going to be is um, a collection of tools and services that for researchers specifically, but also for other people like policymakers, uh, so that they can use those tools and services to understand better uh, the knowledge that we have about food, how it affects people, how it affects the climate, how it affects our economies, and make sensible decisions as a consequence. Personally, um, FNS Cloud means a lot to me. I'm very keen on uh, collaboration, um, using data to its maximum, um, answering questions that we cannot answer individually. And I think using this approach where we can map, merge and reutilize data um, at an open source level or at a shared level to answer questions um, that we don't need to collect more data for. We need to maximize our output from the studies that we do, from the data that we have to answer the important questions that we have now and then those that we have in the future. We have to tend bridges between social sciences and between natural sciences. We have to tend bridges be between um, soci sociologists, anthropologists. We need to tend bridges between all people who, are, who take care of uh, knowledge in Europe. What motivates me here is that this is a very, very interesting project because we have to think about social aspects, economical aspects, technical aspects, legal aspects and, of course, this hard science aspect. Uh, and this is very, very useful in order to know that science is something that must be from the citizens and for the citizens. And this can only be upheld if we do have these kind of connections. Uh, this project is also very uh, relevant politically uh, because uh, the new income, incoming commission uh, on the leadership of Ursula von der Leyen has uh, announced that the Green Deal is one of its top priorities and within that a, uh, a strategy for sustainable food from farm to fork. So uh, this project uh, in particular will contribute quite uh, a lot uh, to, to making that uh, a reality in the future.